Four Saginaw Valley State University students facing criminal charges tonight after an alleged hazing incident. Now school officials say they're educating students about hazing to make sure no one gets hurt. NBC 25's Waller Smith Randolph in the newsroom with more tonight. Walter, how are students reacting to all of this? Bill, students I spoke with are genuinely shocked by the allegations. We're told four members of the Omega Psi Phi fraternity are facing felony assault charges for an alleged hazing incident. While students say they hope the allegations are cleared up, they're also hoping Greek life continues on campus. Tavon Conrad, Lawrence Dunn, Trevor Hoskins, and Maurice Polk facing felony assault charges for allegedly hazing a fraternity pledge at an off-campus house. So many good things they do. I wouldn't believe it happened. The welfare of our students is always our chief concern. The Omega Sci Fi chapter at Saginaw Valley State now suspended. We do all that we can to educate our students to try to make sure that that doesn't happen. Beam says that education includes annual seminars on the dangers of hazing. We have special programs for our Greek organizations, our fraternities and sororities, because this is important not only to the university, but also to their national chartering organizations. Despite the allegations, students like juniors Alexandra Allen and Ariel Crump say Greek life is needed on campus. I personally like Greek life. You know, they do community service out there for the community. They reach out to the kids. Yeah, you know, they support good grades. They do a lot of charitable activity. There's a lot to be learned from that. But it's also important that they adhere to the proper standards. We're told the victim in this case has severe injuries, but officials wouldn't go into details to exactly what type of injuries. As for the group of fraternity brothers, if found guilty and convicted, they could face up to 10 years in prison. Their next court date is December 15th. In the newsroom tonight, Walter Smith Randolph, NBC 25 News. Bill. Thanks, Walter. If we ask the question tonight, are colleges and universities doing enough to prevent hazing on campus? You can vote in our poll tonight at MyNBCNews.com.